excuse me, could you um, score me some sheets? I'm not the housekeeper. I'm your roommate. But you're a... Older. We know that whatever the generation gap might be, your experience will inspire your younger classmates. Zoe, so, we have English class in 30 minutes. I moved all the way across the country to get away from my mom, and what happens, I get my mom as a roommate. Alice Washington, does she treat you like a kid? I feel like we're pretty much equals, except she's really old. She doesn't look old. Well, I guess this little undergraduate folly of yours is really paying off. You call my finishing school the folly? Right after my high school graduation, my dad was diagnosed with cancer. He died a year ago. So what are you going to do with your degree when you get it? Oh, I'm going to teach high school English. I got a feeling you would make an extraordinary teacher, Alice Washington. I want to talk to you. I need some advice. You've come to the right place. So Zoe's rules of dating and seduction. How do you know all this stuff? Let's just say I have a past. What do you think of me as a woman? You're very direct, aren't you? Put your back to your friends, your studies. And you? I have to be honest. No, you, you don't. I can't stop thinking about you, Terry. All that stuff about how she didn't know how to date and she'd only ever slept with her husband. It was all an act. Who even knows how long it's been going on? Report them to the dean. How could you betray me like this? I don't know what you're talking about. You know what about. I'm talking about. Listen to me very carefully, Zoe. Going back to college means everything to me. I don't want to jeopardize my future. You let me see or know you. You let me help you seduce the man I was in love with. This is a very serious concern. What was reported to me was a very clear breach of moral responsibility. I hate this place. I hate college. You think it's simple to drop out of college and go back years later? Think again. Oh, Zoe, it's just a schoolgirl crush. Don't patronize me. And you're a schoolgirl, too. <laughs>